I gave some of that good Holy Spirit love. They were like, oh, I just feel like, can I have some? I said, you sure can. Um, the guy at my Dunkin' Donuts goes, oh, uh, what I got to do to get into your presence? I said, listen, I am a whole different person. You got to know God. You got to get, you got to get right with Jesus Christ to be in my presence, baby. Like, do you want to know Jesus Christ? He said, if I got to get into the Bible, if I got to do Bible study, I will do Bible study just to get in your presence. I said, glory be to God. <laughs> like, yes, I know he's flirting, y'all. But honey, Jesus said, if they want to know, tell them. Tell them on the main line. Call them on the main line. <laughs> Call them on the main line and tell them what you want. That's what he said. That's what he said. Um, but anyway, as I walk in there, though, they asked me about the little boy that I helped out um, last week or a couple days ago. And so I was, oh, oh, Lord. See, your life being neutral and you won't be going nowhere. But you got to check the gear shift. Oh, God just told me that. Literally, because my car was in in the end mode and I, and I pressed gas and I wasn't going nowhere. And God told me just in that and just in that second just i heard very clearly people be in neutral and you think you're going somewhere you're not you're not moving so you today you gotta move today you gotta get up today you gotta move don't just say you believe in jesus don't just say you love jesus don't just say you want his bible don't just say you want his word be in his word get in his word stay in his word remain in his word because his word will set you free it will deliver you from anything telling you anything he's still working with me and i'm just so thankful i'm just so thankful um yes i got my coffee this morning i'm gonna go ahead and take a sip of y'all it's a rainy day so the lord is definitely oh it's gonna be nasty i pray for the people in north carolina and all over there they're dealing with that that hurricane that that water that rain is just washing everything away but I just feel like Jesus is saying, listen, I need to clean house. I need to clean house. It is time to clean house. It's some things that's going on that I do not like. And I need to start from there. And that's where he started. See, the only thing that people don't understand is that they can't control the hills and the waters. They can't control the heavens. They, you can't control that. You can't control. You cannot control fires. You can't control it. That's something that just happens, right? It just happens. Oh, someone's house just caught on fire. How? It just happens. You know, um, a rain, the rainstorm came and it washed away houses. How did that happen? It just happened. No, it didn't just happen. Jesus. Jesus literally is trying to tell us something glory be to god like he's trying to tell us something and we're not listening and so he does things so that we can listen so that we can't open our eyes i i, I listen he will take your he i listen i have heard and i believe it's true because i feel like some people just are are in the holy spirit i feel like some people just have the holy spirit within them and she said Sometimes Jesus will take his hand off of you and just let the enemy touch you and see and, and go ahead and see what happens. Oh yeah. If he uh yeah, you wanna tap into that, you wanna you wanna feel that, you wanna understand that side of the world, I'ma let you do it for a little bit. I bet you you call on me. I bet you you come calling for me. I bet you plead and beg for me. Have mercy on your soul. So I don't even play. I don't play about them. I don't play. I'm on fire for Jesus Christ. And I'm not, I told myself last night and I prayed to him last night. I think I was just praying while I was sleeping, y'all. I, I don't train myself to pray, but I also, you know, pray for peace. I ask Jesus to, um, you know, just humble me, give me peace, give me clarity, uh, and give me understanding. Um, cause yet yeah, I do not know everything and I, and I am still a student. I am still learning. I am still a daughter of you, Jesus Christ. Um, but I do know that I'm speaking the gospel the right way. I'm not prophesying against any, I'm not prophesying over anyone. I know that I am doing what you have asked me to do. And at the end of the day, Lord, I give all the praise to you.